girl didn't give me the signal, man. I'm standing here looking stupid, but whatever. Sorry. It's Saturday afternoon, I guess. It's If you look outside, you wouldn't realize it's the afternoon. It's been getting dark here early in southern Ontario. December 9th, mind you, the weather the last couple of days has been very mild. So we figured we'd take advantage of that. Um, yet yeah, I'm having a beer and a smoke. I'm taking a break. We've just been moving vehicles around. If you kind of look around the shop, you can see we've got the we've got the 52 over on this side because we're going to bring the Corvette in on this side because uh, this is the side I uh, I like to do bodywork and paint. It's a direct shot to the uh, the exhaust fan, which is right there, that little door. Um, I've been doing a little bit of work on the old GT40 quarter scale project. Got lots of filler on it. Uh, not really going to talk too much about it. Probably that's all I'm going to talk about it. Um, but uh, we've got the vet. We've got the motor, tranny in. We got it all hooked up. We got it running. We got it dialed in. I uh, got a little, little brake line leak issue. Uh, we're going to take a little walk outside, and we're going to look at something we haven't looked at in a little while. Kind of sad. Let's go. Follow me. Let's go. We're looking at this, this bad boy or bad girl. or It's not a boy or a girl. It's just a truck. Uh, the box I made. I'm not sure if we did video on that. I think we did show it in the video. Custom made steak pockets. Look at it rusting. It's sad. Here, check this out. Look at the floors inside. All brand new sheet metal. I realize it's just surface rust. It can be taken care of. Unfortunately, this is my ride. And all the projects we do, I've only got a two-car garage. Um, it's a cool garage, though. Don't get me wrong. I want the camera to do the big swing, and you can see the outside from the front. Most viewers don't even know that there's an upstairs to our garage. They might have seen the stairs in the background, but we got some nice storage up there. Lots of automotive parts, lots of storage. Uh, my son's hangout, he's got half the damn garage. Uh, I, I don't know what you want to call it. It's his, his man cave. He is an older teenager. I'm gonna, I'm gonna push the hood up. I haven't even seen it. I haven't seen it for months. Let's see if it still looks the same. Oh, there we go. She's a little dusty. She needs a cleaning. And I'm thinking January. Uh, we're probably going to roll this beast back in the garage. I'm going to get to doing some work on it. So, that's this. What do you say we fire this bad boy up and pull it in the garage? Maybe the camera can go around to the front. Fire it up. We'll pull it in. Let's do it. When you're sitting in this car, you gotta have your uh, you gotta have your racing gloves on.
garage earlier. I had my hand right here like this. Check this out. When I closed the door, see that? Look at where my pinky was. Look at that. Right underneath there. Yeah, and I slammed it closed with my pinky in there. I got a purple pinky. <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say. So, I gotta say, there is nothing like a lumpy cam, some open headers. Uh, I wish I could, I wish I could show you more. I would have loved to have backed this out on the street and just did some wild, crazy launch with it. Uh, it does have line lock, um, maybe a burnout. Uh, it's not my car, unfortunately, so, you know, I, I don't tend to do that with other people's, you know, expensive. I know right now it doesn't look like an expensive car. That's expensive. Once we get her all painted up, it'll be a nice looking drag car. That's for darn sure. Um, so, we got some content out. 9th of December. Not bad, just started spitting out. Uh, you got to see the uh, my 52 sitting out in the driveway, rusting away. We still got uh, vehicles to move around because I actually got another. I got a. It's a Ford shoebox car of some sort, another project which is coming in after the Corvette. Uh, it's actually parked across the street. Um, and uh, yeah, I'm going to pull my truck down. Put that shoebox forward beside it, and uh, and then we've got the whole car swap thing done today. That was not really the objective for today, but I just went for it. I just got shit moved out of the way and got shit moved around because we needed to do it. And I got this feeling, you know, very soon here in southern Ontario, we'll probably get some snow. Temperature is going to change, and yeah, just wanted to get it done on a somewhat nice day today and uh so yeah till the next time we meet sharp customs share like subscribe i hope i said at the beginning we're rolling now we're rolling out so uh thanks to all our new subscribers peace i'm out